Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. This is Nine of Legion, and let's play some more Star Sector version 0.7a. So, last episode we bit off a little bit more than we can chew, and actually ended up losing our ship. We no longer have a Wolf-class frigate, and we are no longer in Corvus. We actually got ejected into an escape pod, which was then picked up in the system of Arcadia. I'm not entirely sure why, because we were right in the orb orbit of Jungala, so we drifted a very long way. But there we go, we are now in a different solar system and we're going to leave um, immediately because there's not really anything for us and there's a very good bounty still in Corvus so I'm just going to head back there and we'll try and do what we were doing before but we'll try and do it better. So we'll see how that works for us. I'm not sure how hyperspace is going to be with the new sensor mechanics. Could be quite terrifying, we'll find out. Now I do have some character points to spend and we're going to continue on our bounty hunting route. The plan is we're just going to put our aptitude point into here and keep loading up on these. I think flux dissipation rate and shield damage are vast improvements, so we want to keep on those. Got three more skill points to spend. I do like being fast and manoeuvrable, and I do like doing lots of weapon damage. So that's, you know, quite clear cut for me. Ooh, confirm that, there we go. Okay, right, we're heading to Searing Passage. Uh, I'm going to turn off my transponder. There, yeah. Uh, something was performing a sensor scan behind me. Okay, what can we see? A fast neutral picket and a mercenary patrol. Looks like they just annihilated something. So here we are. We are down here by Arcadia. We want to get up to Corvus. I should have enough fuel for this. Will it take me more than nine days? I don't know. I hadn't really thought about that, to be honest. If we end up drifting, we end up drifting. Hyperspace is kind of cool now. These kind of hyperspace eddies, like nebula. A little kind of space lightning. That's kind of cool. Okay, and we can head straight back to Corvus. There's a Hegemony patrol over there. Oh no, a Hegemony mercantile convoy. That's fine. Right. And now we're kind of back to where we were. Oh, Relief Convoy just beat up something. Oh, and I've got a pirate raider on my ass. Uh, okay. Now that's bad, actually. Three frigates. And I'm not in a very good combat ship anymore. I'm very, just not very good at playing the game. Um, so we're going to try something here. Uh, where are we? There. Okay, I want to head to Jengal, please. And I'm going to kick in my emergency burn. Uh... No, okay, we're going to attempt to disengage. Ah, uh, they are pursuing me. Okay. This could be bad. Let's see what we can do. We do have our shield. It's not a terribly great shield. Where are the enemy vessels? I can hear sensor beeps. I just can't see anyone. Which isn't bad. Oh. Okay, someone to my left. Yeah, wolf class coming in. Yeah, now this is a problem. He's going to be faster than me. I really don't want to take this fight, to be honest. But, looks like I'm going to have to. How about... Would you like some missiles? You know what? I can actually put out a lot of missiles here. That actually went a lot better than I expected. Oh, someone else has joined the party. Now, unfortunately, I am out of missiles, and I don't even know what that ship is. So... That did take up pretty much all of my firepower. Damn, I could, could have done without that engine here, I'll be honest. Ship, stay on course. Okay, so we did manage to take down one of them, but that used up all of our missiles, so I am quite happy retreating out of that fight. Okay, so that wasn't bad, and we should get paid for that at least. Um, what was chasing us? A Raider Shuttle. 
don't think I've actually seen one of those before. Oop, sorry. A familiar ship to planetary civilians, the Kite Class Aero Shuttle is the day to day reminder of Fabrique Optal's reputation for quality aeronautical engineering, a valuable specialty even in the age of space travel. This com compact space aircraft is streamlined for efficient atmospheric flight and boasts a grid of cleverly distributed short burst maneuvering thrusters coordinated by a delta level AI subsystem to ensure smooth landings. A point driven home by Fabric Marketing by way of amusing ad hollows featuring a well dressed couple and an overfull wine glass. <laughs> Someone had much fun writing this description, I like it. The kite has powerful engines for a civilian ship of its size to ensure speedy transit to and from orbit, though zero-g maneuverability leaves something to be desired when the special subsystem is not engaged. So the special subsystem is maneuvering jets. And that's actually quite well armed for such a small ship. Got a small ballistic mount and two small missile mounts. Okay. I'm kind of glad I ran away from that. Okay, pirates hate me even more. That's fine. Uh, we actually leveled up again. Excellent. Uh... Don't really. Actually, I'm just going to keep putting this combat right now. I uh, I think maybe combat is working for me. Weapon damage always good. Okay. There we go. We are running away. Oh, god, damn it. Well, we were running away. Now we've been caught by a defective wolf class attack frigate and a broadsword heavy fighter wing. Okay, we took out a wolf class on our own, but those broadsword heavy fighters could be a pain in the ass. We don't have any point defense turrets or anything designed to take on fighters aboard this ship. Okay. Let's attempt to disengage. I don't think it's going to work, nor with a wolf class and fighters involved. Yeah, they've pursued me. Okay. Again, we are pretty much aiming to do the whole running thing. We'll see how far we can get before we get caught. The wolf class I think we can handle. If I just unload all my missiles into him, we can probably take him down again. It's going to be those fighters. We are not equipped to handle fighters. I also want to try and steer around the nebula a bit there. It'll slow me down. Now this ship does have the uh, fast missile rack ability, which is why I can reload my missile pod so quickly, just to keep firing off volley after volley. It's very handy, but you run through your ammunition very quickly. Oh. Damn you. I am all out of missiles, but this guy is almost dead. Especially if that last missile could hit. No? Okay. Okay, we can definitely handle individual wolf class ships like that. But only one at a time, because we have to launch all of our missiles to do the job. That said, I am quite liking this little ship. I like ships that have missiles, and we've got some of the best missiles in the game, so that's not too bad. Oh damn, looks like they're actually disabled. We could have captured that if we could have taken on those fighters. Oh, damn. Okay, but we will get another bounty, which is good. And we are almost home. Okay, there's lots of sensor beacons going off around me. That's fine. Hegemony patrol, that's fine. Is my transponder on? No. Okay, transponder is now on. What? No, I just turned it on! Okay, turn the transponder on. Fine. Okay. I... I tried to turn it on. I really did. Okay, so we have made it back to safety. Now, we are... This ship is great on those one-on-one -on -one engagements, but we're not going to be able to handle anything of any number. We do need to s try and find a way of purchasing another ship. So what is actually for sale here at the moment? Not very much, and the Hegemony military still won't sell to us. I don't really want to have to buy from the black market, but... 
I mean, I could pick up a couple of uh, pirate shuttles. I was kind of impressed with their loadouts. Small ballistic and two small missile. Don't know. They've got a lot of bad hull mods. Civilian grade hull, degraded engines, compromised armor, faulty power grid. That's pretty bad. Uh, I could afford a, ham a defective hammer hammerhead class destroyer, which would be interesting. Or I can spend all my money on a carrier and have no fighters for it. That doesn't seem like a perfect thing. I don't really want a combat freighter. I mean, they're just rubbish, quite honestly. Okay, let's leave there quickly. I'll just check out the station and see if it has any different ships. I'm not sure if they share the same market or not. No, it is pretty much the same stuff though, isn't it? Okay, we're going to have to try and make do with what we've got. Uh, luckily we don't need to do any repairs. How are we doing on supplies? Uh, badly. We've only got three left. Okay. We are going to have to buy some supplies. 77 credits. Not the best. Considering all those supplies we had to leave behind earlier. I could be happier about that. Okay, where is Barad? Okay, I want, I'm going to situate myself around here and try and pick up some passing traffic. We want like a smuggler or a very small trade fleet. Oh, you're kicking in. Why are you kicking in? You're pursuing something. Okay. Uh, can I get in on that fight? Yeah, I'm going to join the battle here. We've got plenty of allies to keep us safe. And we could pick up some easy money and supplies. So, let's go in and do this. Okay, we will take command of the action, obviously. And deploy ourselves. Yeah, they're already heavily engaged. I just need to get in there and volley off some heavy missiles into someone. That's basically all I need to do. Those fighters are dying. Which is good, because they were really the bigger threat to me. Where's that wolf class? He's up here. Okay. That's a lot of missiles in the air. Oh, he's down as well. Okay, that was... A very quick fight. I, yeah, we do not get to participate in the salvage operations due to our limited contribution. Read nothing throughout the encounter. Okay, so we're probably going to get nothing for that. Pursuing a pirate scout. I quite like hanging around this guy. If I can get involved in some bigger fights, see again. I wouldn't want to take that fight because of the fighters. But if he gets involved in combat and I can pick up on that, that would be quite handy. Okay, and the hegemony is ever so slightly happier with me. I'm going to actually try something. I'm going to try an active sensor burst right now. What have we got? Okay, so that's the pirate scout fleet. And there's something else down there pursuing a mercantile convoy. It's kind of interesting. Now, I don't want to get attacked by those guys without having them involved. I'm not sure what the range is for that sort of thing. Hmm. They don't look like they're going to catch them anytime soon. Uh, liner convoy, loading passengers. Okay. Oh, there's a fight over here. Who's fighting? Pirate attack fleet versus a mercantile convoy. That is tempting, but I'm going to avoid this fight, because I think the Mercantile Convoy is going to lose. They've got one destroyer, but the pirates also have a destroyer. They've got two Lashes, two Wolf Class, and two Kite Raiders. Yeah, I can't see the Mercantile Convoy winning that fight. And I can't really afford to lose another ship. I can't lose a ship every episode. That would be, that would be terrible of me. Now, if anyone else comes around to get involved in that fight, I would be interested. Is that more pirates? Engaged in battle. Who the hell? Yeah. Yeah, that must have gone very got its arse handed to it. That pirate attack fleet did win. I don't know who they are, but yeah, I'm just glad I wasn't involved in that. 
Let's um, let's get out of here. There's a most of convoy up there. Jimmy patrol just coming into range. They have been up towards Barad. Maybe I should have followed up that way. Ooh, and a patrol, a hegemony patrol? Let's find out. Whose patrol is this? And who's fighting who? Whoop, hello. They're running from a hegemony patrol, so that was the hegemony. Interesting. Could I take both of those? I can take the wolf class, certainly. And the kite itself isn't very powerful. It's got some weapons on it, but nothing much. And they're possibly already damaged. Let's take a look, if we can. I've got a speed advantage. Ooh, there's another big fight on down here as well, by the looks of it. With the privateers getting involved. I'm slightly concerned that the, this pirate fleet does want to engage me. Okay, that fight is over. Privateers pursuing pirate attack fleet. Where's the? How can they even see a pirate attack fleet? Can I see a pirate attack fleet? No. Interesting. Ah, that's a that's a neutral patrol out of Asher, I think. Oh, okay. I might have. Pirate attack fleet engage with those privateers. The privateers are going to lose. We'll get out of there. Okay. They want to fight. There's a patrol coming in after them. I think. I'm not entirely sure. There's a lot going on around here. Okay, we're going to take this fight. We're focused on the wolf. And then the idea... Oh, we do have some allies coming in. Excellent. Okay, this is a nice easy fight then. So we're going to pick this up next episode, so thank you for watching. If you're enjoying this, do leave a like, leave a comment, feel free to subscribe, and hopefully I'll see you later for a successful fight where I don't die. Bye.